into small towns tonight for a reaction to the Religious Freedom Restoration Act. We found one business just 20 miles away from a welcoming South Bend with a much different view. Good evening, everyone. I'm Brian Dorman. And I'm Colleen Borman. The business is Memories Pizza. It's been a Walkerton mainstay for nearly a decade. And tonight, they are standing up for their religious beliefs. This story is just one part of ABC 57's team coverage on the Religious Freedom Act. And tonight, Marissa Keniston also talked with a PR company about this nightmare for the state. But we start with Alyssa, live in front of that business. Alyssa, what do the owners have to say tonight? Well, Colleen, I learned from the workers here at this restaurant that they agree with Governor Pence and the signing of this bill. They say they have a right to believe in their religion and protect those ideals. If a gay couple was to come in, like say we wanted, they wanted us to provide them pizzas for a wedding, um, we would have to say no. Crystal O'Connor and her family are standing firm in their beliefs tonight. They've owned Memories Pizza and Ice Cream in Walkerton for almost 10 years. A small town business. It's a cute little town, Walker, Kentucky. With the small town ideals. We're a Christian establishment. They pride themselves in owning a business that reflects their religious beliefs. We're not discriminating against anyone. It's just that's our belief. And everybody has the right to believe anything. So when Governor Pence signed the Religious Freedom Restoration Act into law, the family was not disappointed. We definitely agree with the bill. I asked her about the negative backlash it's been getting for being a discriminatory legislation. Her response. I do not think it is targeting gays. Yeah. Person. I, I don't think it's a discrimination. She believes it's a way to protect businesses like hers. Oh, it's supposed to help people that have a religious belief. She says because she is a Christian, she and her family don't support gay marriage, and that is their right. I, I agree with the bill. Kevin O'Connor is Crystal's father, and you could say he's set in his ways. He believes the negative backlash the bill and its supporters are getting isn't fair. That's a lifestyle that you choose. You know, I, I, I choose to be heterosexual. They choose to be homosexual. Why should I be beat over the head? Because they choose that lifestyle. And now the O'Connor family tells me that if a gay couple or a couple belonging to another religion stepped into their restaurant to eat, they would never deny them service. They only say they would just not cater their wedding. Reporting live in Walkerton tonight, Alyssa Marino, ABC 57 News.